welcome back to my channel and if you're here for the first time then hey what's up welcome subscribe if you aren't already it as you guys can tell from the title in this video I will be showing you guys how to achieve this nice soft glam makeup look so if you're interested in seeing how I achieved this look which was super 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 easy I promise super easy then um, keep watching but before we get into the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up Cause as you can tell the look is already fire so just give it a thumbs up now and subscribe if you aren't already and without further ado we just gonna get right into the video hi guys so as you can see I did my brows off camera I have my brush in my hand ready to go so the palette that we'll be using for today's look is my Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette um, if you have another palette, preferably black owned, then use that. But this is just the palette that I'm going to use today. So, yeah, we just gonna get right into it. So the first shade that I'm going to go in with is this shade right here. And that is the shade, um, Jax, I believe yes that is the shade Jax, and the brush that i'm using is this moda pro bmx 430 crease brush so i'm just gonna take this shade i'm gonna take my cutie mirror i'm just gonna take this shade and just put it all in my crease area part of my cutie mirror is a bit dusty but nonetheless so i'm gonna just apply this all over my lid basically not just my crease area we're just gonna get that in there and we're just gonna make sure we blend it in real good real good honestly y'all this is a really quick and easy look like real quick so this is on is basically blended in already just gonna blend that in some more a little bit and boom I'm going to drag this out. I'm going to just drag it out a little bit so it's not so harsh. Yep, perfect. All right. That's that's one shade already down already. So now I'm going to um cut my crease. You don't really have to, but I'm going to. So I'm going to cut my crease with some concealer. This is my e.l.f. concealer. So I'm going to just take a flat brush and just cut my crease with it. Not too much either. So I'm going to just take this and cut. And when I cut the crease, I'm not going to like OD cut it towards the bottom. I'm going to just like let it fade. Yep. Just let it fade. So now I'm going to take this smudger brush by the same brand, the Moda Pro. This is the BMX402 brush. And I'm going to go in with this shade right here. That is the shade Silk Cream. So we're going to take Silk Cream. And we're just going to pack it on, baby. Okay? Like, we're just going to pack it on. And it's kind of going to be the same color of this concealer, to be honest. But I'm going to just pack that on. We don't go bang it on it. Oh, slow down, Zay. You're messing up, baby. Slow down. Take your time. Take your time. Ain't no rush, honey. So we're just going to pack that on all over this lid. Okay, okay, okay. By the way, get you a cutie mirror from Capital NYC. Cute little mirror black owned business the link to it will be down in the description box but anyway back to this look so i'm just gonna pack this on just like so so after i'm done packing it on which i'm pretty done right now i'm gonna take this same brush that i used before for that other shade jacks and i'm just going to use what's left over on the brush and just blend that in 
so it's not any harsh lines and it blends seamlessly see what i did there actually i'm gonna like drag this out a little bit and then blend it in again yep perfect perfect so now i'm gonna do the other eye and then we'll be back to finish the 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 entire look and we're back all right so both eyes are now completed so now the next step that i'm going to do is my winged liner y'all just know how i feel about my winged liners <clears throat> so i'm going to do that i don't know if i'm going to use my cat Von d tattoo liner or my nyx mm. We're going to go with the Kat Von D. So I'm going to just take my Kat Von D and focus and um, do this liner. Boom. <sighs> Baby. Yes. Y'all see that? I. I. Let me not get too hyped because this eye be acting up. Period. This one is a little bit higher, but who cares? Who? No one cares. Who's watching? Who's watching? Um. Okay. So next, I'm now that that's complete. I'm going to put on my lashes. The lashes that I'll be wearing today is from Capriol NYC. <laughs> Just promoting everything Capriol. Um, it's from Capriol NYC in the style feisty. I told y'all I was going to wear these lashes for my birthday. And I wore these lashes for my birthday. But I didn't get no pictures. And I didn't get to record anything. So that's why I'm recording it again for you guys. So these are the lashes. Oh my god. They look better on than they even look in the case. And they look mad good in the case. So I'm going to put these lashes on. But before I put them on, of course, I'm going to add some mascara. Honestly, this look is looking real good. And the face is not even beat. Yes. Yes. Like okay so i'm gonna add some lashes i mean some mascara first before i apply my lashes and then i'll be back okay so the lashes are on how cute are these lashes oh my gosh yeah they a lot they a bit dramatic but i love it like it just still goes really well with this soft limb look they are the 25 mm lashes Mm-hmm. So you know this look is about to come together perfectly once I beat my face. So I'm just going to prime with my um pore professional primer and do the rest of my face and I'll be back to show you guys the final look. Okay guys, so I did my face for the most part. I just have to do my lashes, set my face, and then put on some highlight. But I wanted to show you guys my lip combo that I'll be using today. So as you know, regular Degula, I'm going in with my Ruby Kisses um, lip liner in dark brown. So I'm lining my lips. So now that my lips are lined... I'm going to go in with my lip vinyl from Makeup Revolution. You know, I've been using this like a lot recently. I just love the combination. So I'm going to apply this all on the bottom and dab that in. Once that's on, I'm going to take my um, NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Creme Brulee. And I'm just going to dab that on top. And then I'm just going to fill in where, like, the liner seems to have disappeared. Just in the corners and bring that in. Word. And then finally, I'm going to just take a clear lip gloss. This lip gloss is by Vintage. It's Vintage by Jessica, Jessica Lipskin. Don't know who that is. Um, and I'm just going to slide it across right on top. To give it that nice glossy finish okay so now that that lip combo is complete i'm going to set my face with my urban decay ultra matte setting spray all nighter 
Mm-hmm. Ooh. Feels so good. I look so... Ooh. Do y'all see this cheek? Y'all see this cheek action? All right, so now we're going to add some highlight. Ooh, yep. Add some highlight. And boom. Nah, I'm, I'm really looking real snatched right now. Wow. So let me like finish getting cute. Let me fix up my hair. Let me put on some cute clothes and I'll be right back. Alright guys, so that is it for this video. Thank you so, so much for tuning in. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down something below um, and subscribe if you aren't already. That is all for this video, you guys. And I will see you all in my next one. Mwah. Thank you.